the road, welcome to the game of life, also known as democracy. We're gonna do, do a new game here, playing the United States, and we're gonna be the cheese party. And our opponents will be, you guessed it, the soy party. And we're gonna leave everything normal, and we're gonna jump right into this. Congratulations on your election. GDP is quite low, health is low, but education is up. Health is pretty high up. Crime is high, and poverty is a little over, a little under average. So, um, let's see. Parents don't like us. The retired love us. And the wealthy are okay with us. Um, we're okay. We're spending way too much money, though. And our deficit is increasing. And our debt's quite high, too. We'll need to remove these, primarily. And in order to do that, we need this to be a plus. Uh, we need to remove about a hundred dollars, no more like two hundred dollars worth. Mm -hmm. Well, if we help the wealthy, there's no way this will fail. So first thing is, uh, what affects the wealthy? Gated communities, they like that. They don't like state health services, they don't like capital gains, inheritance, income, property, and corporation tax. So, uh... We're gonna help all corporations on all levels here. And if we make this lower, socialists don't like it. Capitalists don't. They enjoy it when it goes down, but it doesn't seem to do anything. So we're not gonna bother with that. Uh, let's see, what else can we do? Let's check out this one. Popularity with the voters is quite high. It's already pretty low. So we're not gonna bother with that either. And uh, so I guess we'll do the inheritance. Popularity with voters, no one likes it. And it doesn't really help our situation at all, so... So the red things we want to get rid of, and the blue ones we want to keep up, and the white ones are neutral, really. Okay, well then in that case, let's try the property tax. No one likes it when we increase this or do anything with it. We get to pay more each quarter. We can't cancel it, so, uh, you know what, let's just not do anything and see what happens. Debt protection law. There's an urgent policy that requires your immediate attention. Debt collection agencies have been in the news because their aggressive methods they are using to extract payment from people who owe large sums of money. These debts Col uh, debt collection agencies provide credit to people whom larger, more respectable companies would not lend any money to. The law is pro uh, a law is proposed to limit the ways in which such agencies can operate. So, do I want to limit agency activity or allow agencies to operate the way they are now? Basically, I can... Um, these agencies prey on the weak and poor in our society, often tricking them into borrowing money and then harassing them. Or nobody forces people to borrow money they can't repay. And to restrict the rights of the debit, debit agencies to recover legitimate debts would be counterproductive. Now, I myself am going to choose to allow people to have more protection Simply because... Anyway, I'm gonna choose to allow credit agencies to uh, not harass their customers because, um... Owning a business, I know that customers come first. If you harass them, you're only gonna have troubles later. So, let's see here. Our debt is not improving. We need to do some serious changes to help with this mini problem. Oh, a tax on gas. It costs us nothing and we can make many. Car usage would go down. That's good. Environmentalists would love it. The GDP would be banned. Tax them. At a point where the motorists start hammered too hard. Yeah, I want to say about 50%. That seems like a fair number. I want to go higher. You yeah, only got 17 left. That should improve some of our money problems. Okay, let's just uh, say, wait, what's this? A missile? 
reusable shuttles, space station, very, very expensive. Mm, I think we should just leave this as it is. GM food proposal. A number of large agricultural companies are in interested in growing genetically modified food on our soil. So do we allow it or ban the sale? I'm going to say we're going to improve because I'm always for improving the shelf life of my cheese. Let's try the smoking. Tobacco tax. We can increase that. And um, we get a lot of money, but I don't think that's going to solve our problems. We don't get a whole lot out of this, so we can drastically reduce this. I don't see how this will backfire at all. The police force. Oh, my. If we increase this... It's gonna cost us slightly more, but plenty of problems will start to re be reduced. And employment will go up. You know what? Let's do that. Make it good. Uh, gated communities. The wealthy like it. Conservatives like it. Increases some crime. Liberals and quality don't like it. It costs me no money. The wealthy like it. It doesn't really affect anything else too much, so we're gonna do that. Here, we'll try out the, uh, the prisons. We can start doing extensive rehabilitation. Crime will go down slightly. State employees will go up slightly. But the cost is just... Mm -hmm. Not sure if it's worth it. But very, very popular with the voters, so we'll do a dance. You know what, let's have it run its course for now. Superhero! Crime and violence has gone down. It's all my doing. I don't know how, but I'll take credit for it. Oh, good. We have a surplus. We're actually going to pay off our debt very, very slowly. And popularity has increased. Excellent. Now, what else can we do here? If we increase this, they get some machine guns. Finally, crimes, crimes go down. Liberals don't like it. I can imagine why. Yeah, we're just gonna leave this be for now. Death penalty. Mass murders only. Eh. It doesn't cost us anything, so we can tinker with this as much as we want. Eh, violent crime does not deserve a death penalty. Maybe rape. So we'll apply it here. Oh, we don't have to capitalist fund for that. Intelligent surveillance. Eh, internet crime goes down. Patriotism goes up slightly. Liberals go down, crime goes down. It's just good in general. So we'll apply this. Let's see, rails, subsidiaries. If we reduce this slightly. So if I remove it down to about 50. That keeps us in the medium range as well. So we'll apply that. Biofuel subsidiaries. I would like to increase this, but I don't think that's a wise idea. Because that costs us money. But we'll remove this down to... Uh, barely fitty. School buses. Parents don't like it if we reduce this. We have it on very high. Maybe if we lower it down to a low high, that'll save us some money. And I think that might be enough for now. Vigilante mobs are now at an end. I'm helping. Hybrid cars. Hmm. Cost a lot of money. Hey, wait a minute. We have four. So if I increase the tax on this. Car usage goes down. So that's good. We can get a lot of money off of car taxes. It doesn't really hurt the middle earnings too much. It hurts membership membership. But it's not too bad. So we're going to apply this. And at the same time, increase this probably to maximum. That way we get money and help with the uh, with that problem. Alcohol consumption can be variedated with this. Minimum age is 21, 18, 20. Oh my. Minimum age is 21. No one likes it. We could make this no limit, but um. I don't know, it just doesn't feel right. Liberals will love me, alcohol consumption will go up, which is bad. And if I increase it, violent crimes go down a little bit. Youth doesn't like me. Liberals don't like me. 
Does it cost anything now? Voters don't like it now, so we're just going to ignore this for now and see what happens. I don't have a whole lot of points left anyway. Oh, there's a dilemma? Child labor law! Oh my! Let's shake up the children! Ban tobacco adverts. Hmm. So if I reject the ban, that means they can ruin the health. Which we can't afford right now. Smoking kills. Property tax. There you are. We're going to increase it to 10%. Let's look at the parties. We're doing quite well. Um, let's see. We could probably just stay the course pretty much. Um, I would like to get the health problem better off, but I don't see that happening too well. Citizenship test. Patriots don't like it too much. Racial tension goes down. You know what? I like these changes. Let's do it. And it's cheaper. Border control. Costs us less money. I can't see how this will be bad at all. Public smoking ban. We'll ban it. Because we really need to improve the health problem. The liberals are very low. So if we do this, we can trade religious with liberals. Maybe we should find an even footing. That seems about right. Appoint a UN ambassador. Well, everyone likes him, so we kind of have to go with him. My election report. I'm gonna win! We still have a bit of a surplus, so we're slowly taking the debt down. Let's see, school vouchers. This costs us money! If we cut it down to about... So we'll drop this to about there. Food stamps. We're giving out a lot of food stamps. Let's lower that a bit. Into 10 million. State pensions. That's quite a lot of money being thrown around here. Not too worried about retired folk. Because when you own your own cheese factory, you don't need to worry about pension. So I don't know why they're upset. There we go. We'll save lots of money. All right. Yeah, let's see. Go pro employer. Okay, and we're done for the day. Oh, children's food. I want to say this will help us with the parent problem because um, they don't really like us too much. The youth already kind of likes us. So I'm going to say we're going to regulate the food because parents would like that, right? Right? Hmm. Unemployment benefits. So we need to improve education. Eh, it's only one extra meal. We actually have a surplus of almost 200. So we're actually hurting the debt. Hmm. We can't really do too much else. So we're going to end our turn. Immigration scandal. Get farmers. Yeah, they're okay. So we'll maximize that. Credit rating upgrade. Yay! So let's increase this to 20%. Yes! Yes! We'll kill the dead! One way or another. Ban alcohol advertisements? Um, still need to get parents to like me, so I think they would approve. So we need to tackle road building and railway support, but I already lowered this, didn't I? Unemployment is hurt by this, which is a good thing. So we'll increase this to about... Oh, this hurts the motorists. That's good. That means we'll have less pollution. We should definitely do this. Almost 4,000? Uh, 400? We'll throw this from... What was it? 47? So we'll make it 147. There we go. Even better. Terrorist attack. Oh no! We failed! Oh no, we lost quite a little bit from that. But our credit rating went up. Strikes. Oh. That's not good either. I need to see what the parties are doing. Oh, we dropped hard. Um. Hmm. Um. Um. Let's see. Uh, oh, it's the problem again. That's right, the strikes. 
Um, what is causing the strikes? There we are, pro employer. If we go back this way, it doesn't cost us too much. And that will hurt the working week. Wages go up. General Strike is hurt real hard by that, so we will improve upon that. Let's see here. Didn't I lower this? Yeah, let's take this down to about 25. Apply. Okay. And that's all we can spend today. Uh-oh. Oh, no. No, no. No, 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 no. I was doing so good until the very last second. Alright then. Well, there you have it. People are stupid. They don't like progress. They want to stay in debt. Remember that next time you go to vote.